Hey, what is going on everybody? My name is Star Lords. I hope that you guys are having a fantastic day and today we're actually going to be doing a video on Super Power Training Simulator. I know that you guys have really enjoyed the videos on my YouTube channel from this and uh, they actually had a brand new update like last night I think so I thought I would actually go over all of the new changes in the update and also give you guys a little bit of a tip on how to oh my god I'm flying everywhere um, how to actually go and upgrade your character a lot more and also some of the new features that you might not know about in this update including a very secret one at the end of the video so please do not miss out on that watch the whole thing guys it is very very important and uh, now before we do get into the video guys please do not forget to leave a like and also click that subscribe button if you haven't already as we are now at around about 200 320 thousand subscribers or something like that so join the subscriber squad and uh, yeah click subscribe turn on notifications to never miss a video uh, but before we actually do anything i'm actually going to go over a brand new thing that they added in this update and i'm actually going to be doing a giveaway of this sometime very very soon all you have to do is go into the menu settings you go over to where it says i think special yeah and here you'll see it actually has a brand new option so that you can actually gift tokens to people in your game now what that actually means is see these little tokens right here that you use to upgrade your character as you can see if i go to my character i've upgraded them quite a lot like i have 512 uh, times 512 fish strength uh, times 128 body toughness and the same for psychic power and then just 8000 or 8 uh, for movement speed and jump speed well, well, these little multipliers actually help you upgrade your character in game a lot quicker than it would normally be so for example if i wanted to fly and train my psychic power as you can see i get 1200 psychic power every single second when i'm training it and um, so what i'm actually going to be doing is doing a little bit of a giveaway on this and i'm actually going to be gifting tokens to people who get in my games in roblox every now and then uh, for example corby's right here Corby's a pretty cool dude. He's actually followed me for quite some time right now. Uh, he's actually been a subscriber of mine for quite some time. And uh, right there, you know, it's only 100 Robux, but I purchased for, for him and I've actually gifted him the tokens right there so that he can actually have them. I don't know whether it actually shows up on his screen that I actually gifted them. I'm not too sure how this works, but I'm going to be doing that to a lot of people in my game. So all you have to do is add me as a friend. My username is the legendary Star Lord. No spaces. It's up there in the top right hand corner if you guys want to see uh, the actual gamer tag or the name I guess. Uh, so feel free to add it and uh, just join my games and I will actually gift them to you whenever I can. Um, I'm not too sure if he knows that I've actually just gifted him. I don't think it gives him a little bit of an indicator that I've just gifted him. But you guys saw that I did give him 400 of those little skull thingies so that he can use on his characters. That's pretty darn cool. Um, but other than that, we're about to go over some of the uh, the new updates. Well, hey, who are you shooting at, bro? Um, let's go over some of the new updates that they actually added into this uh, kind of update. Uh, the first thing is they've added killing intent aura. So basically, when you are intending to kill people, you will now glow with an aura around you, such as the one that I've got right now. As you can see, I've got this aura around me. I can turn it off and on, but this is my power aura. Um, whereas the killing intent aura is something that I think Corby's got right here. Uh, so as you can see, it's really red. He's got fire coming from his hands. And it's kind of showing that this dude wants to kill people. So stay away from him because he is training to be a super villain. So, you know, that's um, pretty interesting stuff that they decided to add that. But it only works on people with 100 times lower size psychic power so you know you have to have 100 times lower psychic power than the person that you've killed or that you're killing yeah that one i don't know it's confusing but you guys probably get the gist um other than that they also added in the gifting token system which you guys already know about and i said that i'm going to be doing giveaways of that and um, that is just found in the specials tab where it says gift tokens here and uh, yeah that's pretty much all you can do you cannot gift vip though i don't know why he's not gave us the option to do that but I don't know, you can't gift VIP, which is really crappy, because I would prefer to gift people VIP rather than gifting them tokens. I don't know, I just feel like VIP is better than tokens. Um, other than that, they added in custom MS, JP, and FS. You guys probably don't know what this means, but if you go to the menu settings, go to settings, go all the way down, you can actually see that you can alter your run speed, your jump power, and your flight speed. And uh, a lot of people have actually been asking me in my last video to make a guide on how I actually fly so fast in this game. I'm going to have a guide uh, coming up in the next day or two, so guys, do not miss out on that because it is actually pretty simple to do, but not a lot of people actually know how to do it. So I thought I would actually do it for you guys. 
and just help you all out. And I'm pretty sure that all these guys are like my subscribers right now. That's pretty cool that they got into my games. Hey, how you doing? Um, other than that, they improved the flight animations too. So if I just go and fly, you will see now that the flight animations are a little bit different than they used to be. There's actually something weird that's went up with this update, and that is that the VIP cape is now attached to my ears. So I don't know exactly what that they've done with that. I don't know whether it's my character model or something, but uh, hopefully that should be changed in the next update. Someone just killed me because I am weak as heck on this game now. Uh, but yeah, so as you can see, the VIP cape now looks a little bit different. It hangs off my ears, which is really strange. Uh, him, but also the flying animation is just a little bit improved. And I think, is, the, is this animation improved? Um, see, this animation is really weird too. Like my hands are no longer on my body. Like if I just kind of go left to right, you can see that my hands are no longer attached even a little in the slightest bit to my body when I'm actually doing that. So that's actually really, really strange, uh, the way they've updated the models. Um, other than that, they've added in a, v a new VIP tag. So if I just kind of say hi in the chat, you'll see now uh, that where it says hi, I have a new crown next to my name, which just kind of indicates to everybody that I have the VIP package and that I am a VIP in the server. And of course, my text is also yellow so that most people can actually see uh, when I'm typing and everything like that. So that's actually pretty darn cool. I thought that was awesome that they did that. It added that little kind of crown in to make it look a little bit better. Uh, but not only that, they added one more thing or they fixed one more thing and that was the 5,200 tokens in the one and three month VIP passes and the XP GUI spamming. So for example, nowadays, if you spam like kind of the, I guess just three and three and three, it'll no longer show that you're getting multiple psychic power at once. So uh, anytime you ever see like two psychic powers popping up on your screen, that is legit two psychic powers now. So um, it's interesting anyway. I thought it was really strange, uh, but it's cool that they actually added that in and fixed it for everybody to not kind of confuse everyone because I know there's a lot of people getting confused about how much they were actually earning. So it's kind of cool that they no longer do that, if that makes sense. Um, other than that, I did say that there's actually something really secret in this update and uh, it is pretty cool actually it is very very cool and uh, yeah I'm gonna show you guys right now but uh, one second I just need to go and fix something on my game it's kind of crashing a little bit uh, my game's kind of lagging I don't know I can imagine that my audio is really messing up in this video right now uh, so I do apologize uh, but anyway uh, so when you're actually in the game right there's a brand new update coming on the way and they've actually gave us a little bit of a sneak peek into this which i thought was really really cool hey how you doing dude hello <laughs> um but anyway what you want to do is go to menu once on menu we're going to click on settings and then on settings presuming that you start at the very top where it says only damage villain option if you just kind of scroll down very slowly you will actually see that there is a new option here and it's turned off automatically and it says auto training coming soon. So this is very strange. I actually uh, didn't think that they would add this in, but basically what they've done is they know that a lot of people uh, go AFK and farm their punching powers and stuff like that. You know, like basically a lot of people just kind of like, oh, I killed three people. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, so a lot of people, what they do tend to do is they have an auto clicker on their PC. They go and fly up to this crystal right here. They'll click on it and they will just constantly um, hit the crystal and walk away. They'll leave their auto clicker on. So it's clicking it forever and they'll come back back in like two hours time and have their fish strength really really high up and um, that's actually really cool that a lot of people do that but what's even cooler is that the developer knows that this is going to be an unbeatable thing like people are going to do this no matter what so instead of trying to patch it and trying to fix the game like that he's going to actually add in an option where if you don't have an auto clicker you can automatically train all of your skills just by clicking on this setting right here in the actual settings menu. So I thought that was a really cool subtle kind of uh, update to kind of show us what is coming soon in this game. I think that's really cool. I would presume that it's coming in the 1.7 up update maybe, but again, I don't know how hard it is to actually implement something like this into a game. So we could actually be waiting maybe one or two um, one or two updates for this, I think, maybe. Uh, but as soon as the update comes out, guys, you know that I'll have an update video for you. I'll uh, make a guide on how to actually go about doing it, what the best kind of way is to uh, farm your uh, different kind of stats and everything like that. So, you know, if you do want to actually see that, make sure to click subscribe, turn on notifications, and don't forget to leave a like on this video. Uh, not only that, but before I actually end today's video, guys, I actually have a Robux giveaway coming up very soon. I actually have a little bit more money than I thought in my bank account. 
and uh, yeah, I'm going to be doing a Robux giveaway for a lot of Robux uh, sometime very soon. So, if you guys want to get in for a chance to win some free Robux, uh, all you have to do is go over to my Twitter account. The link will be in the description below uh, somewhere in this video. Click on it and it'll actually link you to my Twitter account. All you have to do is follow, turn on the tweet notifications, and whenever I actually do a Robux giveaway, all you guys have to do is see that, like the tweet, and that is pretty much it. But if you don't have Twitter, don't worry about it. There also will be giveaways for people who add me as friends on Roblox and also follow me or whatever else, you know. So it's, there's something for, shut up phone, there's something for everybody. So yeah. Um, other than that, guys, thank you very much for watching today's video. I do hope that you have an awesome weekend. And uh, yeah, hopefully there will be a load more content on my channel in the next couple of days uh, to do with Pet Simulator, uh, Superpower Training Simulator, and uh, also, there's a couple more simulators that have just been updated on Roblox so if you guys want to get definitely get in and uh, see some guides on those please feel free to comment down below what games I should try and also don't forget to keep on checking on the channel every single day because that's how much I upload uh, other than that guys guys really awesome day and until next time I've been so long. see ya